Hi, this is Dr. Dave Martin, your absolute podcast beginner. Again, this is going to be kind of a neat session because I've last time I told you that I kind of got the podcasting all figured out. Well, this is going to be a little video that's going to show you exactly what I use. And I'm actually going to lay the products out on the table and go through them one by one and talk to you a little bit about how much it costs and the whole setup. You can do a professional setup for about, and excuse me for rolling the eyes again, it's a bad habit of mine, but you can do it for about, I'm going to say about 170 to 175. One of the things that I forgot to mention in the, in the quick clip you're going to see is the, you need a mic stand. The Rode Podcaster, the pod mic, it's really heavy and you're going to need a mic stand. You can get a really good mic stand for about, I want to say about $30, $35 from Amazon. But that's going to bring your price up to about $170. So let's go ahead and get into what I think is some of the best equipment. So I've introduced myself, and let's get right to it. This is what I consider the minimal equipment, anyway, it was for me to actually start a really high quality podcast recording. I use this for all my podcasts and this one is going to be a little grainy because I'm recording it using my iPhone. But the all the podcasts that I do, I'm using this equipment. So let's get started. We start with the Rode mic and I'm going to open up the package. This is from Rode and it is their premier podcast mic it is a great one it's the the best quality mics i've i tested several different types of mics this one works for me you can get this on amazon for about 99 dollars. it's the thing that will start you off well from there from having a really good mic it's pretty simple let's move over to the next thing and i got for an individual uh, podcaster you don't need to have a fancy Real fancy setup. Now, I, I do have one because I'm going to get more advanced in my podcasting and mixing the videos and podcast. And so I went ahead and got this, and you'll see it over here. This is the, the Rodecaster Pro, but you don't need that. A beginner can start with just this. This is a Scarlet Solo. Again, you get it on Amazon, and it's for a mic, and it's for an input for, for a musical instrument, and it works great. So we have the podcast mic, we have the Scarlett Solo, which hooks up with a USB, so it's a, it's a USB-C, so you have to make sure you've got the right USB-C to, if you've got a USB port on your computer, that's great, but if you don't, then you're going to have to have a USB-C to a normal USB adapter. These are the mic adapters for the mic, for the, the Rodecast mic. Again, you can get these um on amazon and they're ten dollars uh, if you want you don't need this but if you want to monitor yourself there's a you can get any number of headphones from inexpensive this pair comes from again i got it f just from a generic company on amazon pretty good quality uh, about forty dollars and then finally the last thing i'm going to move all the way over here you don't need, I don't think you need a pop filter with the the, the uh, Rode Podcaster. I've done both. Um, I've used a pop filter, and I, I use a pop filter now. But I, I've also used it without a pop filter. It's kind of hard to notice the difference. But this whole audio set, the pop filter, the pod mic from Rode, the Scarlet Solo, and the, the cables and the headset. This is probably maybe going to cost you a little bit over $100 when, when all is done. Maybe $150 when all is said and done. You will be able, for $150, and your, of course your computer, you're going to be able to compete with the pros. This is great stuff. And again, I've learned this from testing a lot of different equipment. And I'm not getting paid by anybody to make any of these recommendations. It's just from everything 
that I've experimented and played around with so far for a podcast, this seems to be the best setup. Again, it's the pop filter. You can get any generic pop filters. You, again, you need to get a really good, the main thing is the mic. And I, I can't speak highly enough about the Rode pod mic. Then this particular one, one input for the, the mic, and then you've got the proper cables and the optional headset if you're, going, if you're going to mic to monitor yourself. And then, of course, you've got to set it up with your computer. That's what works for me, and I will post this up here in just a, a few minutes. Well, indeed, that's what works for me. There's a, just a couple of things that I want to end this podcast with, and that's, I forgot to mention the mic, the mic stand. That's going to set you back about $35. So now we're talking about maybe $185. And the other thing that I need to clarify is, why do you need this the Scarlett Solo? The Scarlett Solo is an audio mixer. You'll need to have some sort of audio mixer to mix the audio from the pod mic from Rode into your whatever computer program that you're using to record your podcast. That's the cheapest uh, setup that I could get. Uh, again, the, the, the Scarlett Solo audio mixer allows one mic input and one instrument input. And if you're a singer-songwriter and you don't plan to interview anybody, that is all you need. The other quick thing that I wanted to mention is you may have noticed that my face is a little bit brighter and that's because I've gotten a backlight to diffuse it a little bit, the, the light, and make this a little bit better. I'm still playing around with videos and lights and backlights, but that's getting a little bit better. But again, this is Dr. Dave Martin, the absolute YouTube beginner. And I just thought it would be kind of neat to let you know the solution that I've arrived on that I will be doing all of my future podcasts and all of my live YouTube vid videos with this audio setup. It's a great setup. Talk to you soon. Thanks for watching. And oh, by the way, I am going to do what the pros do. If you like these videos subscribe to my channel. I only have six subscribers now. And I mean, I really don't care, but I'm going to start doing that just so I can hopefully grow an audience. Talk to you soon.